thank you so much, uh, Professor, for your elaborated response to uh, uh, the above questions. Mm. So, um, on the other hand, uh, North Korean involvement also add the uh, complexity to an mm. already uh, tense geopolitical in situations, mm. and uh, the Asia Pacific region could see this destabilization mm. if the North Korea strengthens its ties with Russia through the active military engagement and also through the uh, the treaty that you mentioned earlier. Mm -hmm. So from your point of view, how does the North Korea's uh, direct involvement in the conflict impact the security landscape in the Asia-Pacific region and possibly the wider global order? Yes, thank you. It's a very important question because you see direct involvement of the North Korea in the war, how it will impact regionally. Inter before I give you the answer of this question, let me give you some background mm. of the North Korea. I give you some fact and figure about the North Korea army. What is the, where the North Korea stand today? Okay, now this, today the uh, North Korea has active, now North Korea have an active army of 1.2 million. Active army. And they have a reserve around over 600,000. Over six. So if you combine together army, they have about 2 million. Now, according to static, the North Korea stand number four in the world in the army strength. China, India, USA and the North Korea. So strength, if you're talking about the strength of the army, so North Korea stand number four in the world. Now, after this, North Korea uh, have a, you know, North Korea conventional or army uh, is divided into the five part. You know, you, you can categorize in the five part. Uh, number one is the ground forces. Number two is the Navy. Number three, the air and the anti-air force, a special operation force, and number five is a rocket force command. So the whole army is completely modernized and they have their section. Which section will control what? Uh, number three part is uh, North Korea also have, a, no, North Korea is also the nuclear state. So according to the one estimate uh, around uh, North Korea have around uh, uh, maybe uh, around 40 to over 100 uh, assemble nuclear warhead. Nu you assemble nuclear warhead. They have around over 100 nuclear warhead, and then they have a delivery system. Delivery. They, they have a capability of delivering up to the over 12,000 kilometer. So, okay, so now they have a conventional weapon and then they have a nuclear arsenal, which is which is uh, around uh, maybe 1,000 ballistic missiles they have, ICBM. So they have uh, over 1,000. Now, after that, number third, they also, they have a stockpile of the chemical weapon. According to the one estimate, they have around 250,000 to five thousand ton of chemical weapon chemical they can use in the warfare so now you understand the north korea is a capable of the three uh three side of the weapons they have a conventional weapon nuclear weapon and also the chemical weapon now your answer your question is the direct involvement of the north korea how it will impact it will be a disaster. It will be a disaster. Now this is a time the NATO, especially the Western country and America should realize that this war should be stopped now before it get late. So involvement of the North Korea directly will have a disaster impact not only in the Southeast Asia or East Asia, but globally, because it will affect the, the food security uh, and, the, and, the, and the food security, security, and also the peace, economic, 
economic development and supply chain they will all affect by this thing so you have to understand this thing that north korea is a well equipped country when it is uh, it when it, as long as concerning about the weapon so direct involvement will be disaster so my point to be is very clear that they should have to come up some idea uh, some sort of negotiation political settlement of this issue you know from the last two years china been trying very hard to to stop this war the china been trying from the last two years trying and then they presented a 12 point peace plan and then the most of the country around the world they accepted it china is trying to bring in the peace between uh, these two country but actually the uh, the the problem is ukraine ukraine is is actually is not listening what the what the country who are supporting peace are talking about but he listening to those people who want to perpetuate the war and continue the war in the region so actually this is a time involvement of the north korea is a sign that this war should be stopped now if it is not maybe it will be change into the wider or the war will be expanded and it will be disaster.